Hi everyone. Welcome to this quick video talking about the Iracos Weekend Workshop that I will be doing at Brent International School. I'm so excited to head back to Manila for the second year in a row talking about AI and education. This year we'll be focusing on teaching, learning, and assessing and creating our own AI bots. Now the registration for this event can be found in the description of this video or uh, on the iracos.org website. But again, uh, here's what we have is this will be an Iracos featured weekend workshop for you Iracos schools. That means you will get a discount. Uh, it'll be running a Saturday, Sunday, October 19th and 20th, and it'll be hosted uh, at Brent International School. What I'm excited about is going beyond where we were last year at this time. Last year, I came in and did a two day uh, Iracos workshop at Brent, and I'm excited to come back again. Here's what I wanted to go over that we'll be talking about this time. Last year, when I was there, we were just talking about introducing people to ChatGPT and to generative AI. And of course, in one year's time, uh, there have been a lot of advancements. So this time we're gonna start up here in the top left-hand corner with going beyond the intro. We're gonna be looking at different prompting techniques. Uh, over the last year, people have found different things that work. We're gonna be looking at, breaking down, playing with, talking about how these different prompting techniques can be used in our classroom and why they are so powerful for students as well. We're also going to be learning to analyze data uh, where we're going to encourage you to have a ChatGPT Pro account, which is gonna allow us, unlocks a whole nother range of ideas and ways to use generative AI. I'll be talking about that a little bit more. And we're going to be exploring different AI bots. Last year, we focused specifically on ChatGPT. This year, we're going to be expanding that into other AIs. Uh, we'll be playing with Gemini. We'll be playing with Perplexity. We'll be playing with Claude. Uh, we'll be playing with a lot of different AIs. So come ready to set up accounts on different AIs. Uh, have your email ready to go and be ready because we just need to explore. We need to look at what's working. How do these different AI bots give us different data sets? They're trained on different things. They're all being used in different ways. And so we're gonna be playing with a lot of them, comparing and contrasting so that we can support students in using the best AI bots for their learning as well. We're gonna be focused a lot on classroom structures. What structures need to be in place within our classrooms and our schools around student learning and through Gen AI. Through the work I've been doing over the past year, I've been writing a lot of guidance and policies with both schools, schools districts, and states here uh, in the United States, as well as with a couple of you international schools in the Iracos region. We're gonna be looking at what are some of those things that need to be put in place both at the classroom level and at the school level to make sure that we are leveraging this in what we consider a human-centered approach. And so we have guidelines uh, and all kinds of great things that we'll be digging in there as well if that is something that interests you. Of course, we will be focused on assessments. How do we change assessments in the world of generative AI? Uh, we'll be looking at how do we move beyond this idea of plagiarism. We're even going to be able to look at how do you create a new rubric in the world of generative AI and what should be the things that we are assessing in generative AI. Some great conversations to be had around that. But a big part of what I am hoping to focus on here is over here on the right, that is creating your own custom AI bots. Now, in order to do this, you will need to have a ChatGPT Pro account. Uh, you can sign up for one that is $25 a month, or if your school already has a ChatGPT Teams account, that's $20 a month. Uh, or $25 a month, sorry, um, you can uh, bring that as well. So you want to have a ChatGPT Pro or Teams account when you come to this training so that we can create custom AI bots. Now we are going to start playing with, and our goal is, is that you will leave with a cu couple of custom AI bots to leverage either at your school, in your classroom, or for your department. Because the real power and where this generative AI is going is not making larger models, but making very small specific models for the individual user. That's what we're gonna start playing with because as the future of generative AI unrolls, we're going to see more and more of these uses. And we're gonna play with a couple of those uh, here, but you're going to need to have a ChatGPT Pro account, even if you only sign up for the weekend while you're there, um, it's going to be worth your time and energy to see what does the higher level of these bots really allow us to do? Then of course, on Sunday, 
October 20th, you are going to have a lot of time to work. On day two, I will be giving you ample time to work on creating new learning opportunities. Maybe you need to create a new unit. Maybe you want to think of creating new outcomes. Whatever your role is, you're going to have time to really dig in and create some artifacts to take back to your school as we start to leverage this. And of course, everything we do is going to be through a human-centered approach. We're going to make sure that we're using AI in a way that empowers us to do more creative things as humans. So with all that, I'm very excited to be back again, coming to Manila and to Brent International School for another Iricos Weekend Workshop. I hope that you can join me October 19th and 20th as we go deeper into understanding how generative AI supports us in education. I'll see you there.